Hallie Pilot joins you now. She was at the premiere of Evita last night. SN is a proud media sponsor of this production. So how was the play finally getting to see it come to life? It was, it really was amazing. I mean, I've gone to these events and they keep talking about the costumes and music. They kept saying there's going to be more of everything this year at the Oslo. And there were, I think she had like 50 costume changes. And it's really cool because she rises like to power in Argentina and her costumes kind of evolve with her. So it was really cool. And I was talking to the director, choreographer Josh Rose, and then the producing artistic director, Michael Donald Edwards. And they just said they really put their heart and soul into everything. Evita is this epic, beautiful rock pop opera, and we wanted to, to sort of make it uh, on a grand scale. We wanted to make it this gorgeous opera. People must see this. This is the must-see event of the Sarasota season right now. So to finally, I guess, be there and see the costumes come to life, what was, did you learn anything new? I mean, you did a story on this and previewed the thing, and you're at the meet and greet, but seeing it live, did anything else kind of stick out to you? Yeah, honestly, like things that you wouldn't really think to look for yourself, but kind of after talking to them, like the way they use the lights to show, you know, her rising to power. You know, the beginning starts out much darker. She's poor, she's growing up in Argentina, and then kind of as she comes to power, like the lights are brighter, the music's louder, and it really just everything. And I had never seen a show at the Oslo, and it's such a big production, and I didn't realize how intimate the theater was. It really is much smaller than I anticipated, so that was really cool actually. Where can people get tickets to see the play? Uh, go to osloRep.org and it runs through December 30th.